Hi, this is a uh, Sea Tech decking. You know, uh, I had it all over this boat. I mean, I had piles of this crap the previous owner had put on. And they covered the gunnels with it, the cockpit deck. I mean, it's fun. It's nice. It's comfy to, you know, it's soft. You can fall on it. I ran up you know, the, 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 the deck here on the, on the side. It was all over the bow. It was all over the cabin roof and the bow. I mean, it's just miserable to remove. It's miserable to remove. I know no other way to remove this stuff except slowly pulling up strips of it. You just cut it, cut, cut it into strips. I, f I found that I think going with the grain worked better. There's a grain in this one. And then you just slowly peel it back and it's just slow. I think maybe a little warmer temps help it maybe in the 70s 80s uh, it didn't really matter you know it's this pressure sensitive adhesive so if you're lucky when you pull it up you'll get a lot of the adhesive with it but if you're not so lucky it leaves it on it leaves it behind so then you take a razor and you i mean this is a chisel sharp chisel and just uh just, get it up as much as you can. This is awful stuff. You know, I mean, so you get it up and then mineral spirits seems to be the best thing. I mean, I've used kerosene, lacquer thinner and acetone will work, but they just evaporate too fast. You need something that uh, doesn't evaporate, and, you know, quickly mineral spirits a good quality mineral spirits seem to work the best and you just get a rag and soak it and then come back with your with your your razor and it'll it'll get it pretty pretty clean you know and then you got to wipe it again it's just i don't know what else to do i mean you can use there's adhesive removers i didn't try any of those google and whatever i don't i don't see how they could be much different maybe um Goof off. I think I tried it. Goof off. Lemon oil. Uh, it, it, it's got to be something that that le it doesn't evaporate. So like an oil. And then you're dealing with you got to clean the oil off after that. So I would not recommend putting this stuff on. I I don't know what I would put it on. I I don't I don't like it. But you know this is this is all going to get shared out it'll get uh you know the glass will get repaired and then primed with um all grips 545 primer a couple coats of that two or three coats and then uh all grip uh the the uh original two-part l linear polyurethane all grip with non-skid flattens out real well but um what else can i say with this stuff you know you can use a dremel with a with the razor thing on it but it, that leaves a lot of adhesive behind you know the, the best is if you can peel it up like here i lucked out you know it, it came up with a lot of the adhesive but there's always parts of it and it, you know if you hit it with a sander it'll gum up the sander unless i mean unless you're real aggressive on it but I, I i don't know why anyone would would put this down except to you know as a quick fix i guess anyhow that's it hope you found this helpful